Peggy 12. In this moving picture, we'll examine how to deal with disasters. In SimCity, natural disasters happen randomly, thereby reducing carefully crafted cities to rubble and wreckage. Take, for example, a city created by Chelsea McCrill of Little Rock, Arkansas. Clearly, Chelsea has put all of her development into industry, thus neglecting civic values such as police, hospitals, and fire stations. As we can see here, this was an ill-advised decision. So much for the march of industry. Next is Monolithburg, a creation developed by Howard Chesterton of New Haven, Connecticut. Obviously, Howard, you're a man that believes bigger is better. We, however, disagree. With no means of repair, he'll have plenty of time to consider his inadequacies. This is Taylor Town, made by Taylor Smith of Spokane, Washington. Taylor has built a modest community with citizen safety in mind. Unfortunately for him, safety is not our priority. Ta-ta, Toto. And now, let's see how each subject handles cleanup and repair. As expected, Taylor is in tip-top shape. Not so much for money bags to see her. And certainly not for high-rise hours. Splendid! So we can conclude. No fire trucks, plus no hospitals, plus no police, equals complete and utter disaster. And now, a word from our sponsors. Now you know how to deal with disasters. Best of luck building, as you never know which disaster will strike next. Cheerio! Sim City, coming February 2013. Pre-order now, before it's too late.